Hi everybody, my name is Julie Nolan. I am an art therapist at McGee Rehab Hospital in Philadelphia. I wanted to take a couple moments to tell you a little bit about my friend, Dr. George. He is somebody that I actually met um, when he was a patient here. And the first time I met him, he was barely able to keep his eyes open because he was still very new, very fresh, and very early on in his healing process from a spinal cord injury that occurred in his home. The reason that I stopped in to meet him was because his daughter stopped me in the hallway. She saw me pushing my art cart and she said, my dad, he's here, he's new, he just got here, but please, please, please put him on your radar. He, he really loves art. He had just started taking painting lessons not too long ago. I think he would really like to meet you. And so I went in knowing that, that he had a, a previous interest, but um, not much more. And, um, you know, our work together in the beginning was just talking about art and talking about the concept of art therapy. And at first I could kind of tell that Dr. George was just humoring me by letting me spend time with him because his dominant hand was not working following his injury. And he now tells me that he thought, what on earth, art now? Absolutely not. Um, but over time, we continued to work together and build a relationship and practice using his non-dominant hand to make paintings. And um, fast forward to several years later, and his artwork now covers the walls of this hospital and um, brightens so many patients, staff, family members' days and lives and recovery. Um, I get people asking me all the time about these paintings um, and it might be, you know, they just want to know more about the artist or they want to know how they can make a painting like that. Or maybe they just want me to know that it's meaningful to them to have that work on display. Um, and it's really amazing to see how far Dr. George has come uh, from our very first pieces together, um, which were very experimental. and. Um, to see how his artistic identity has really evolved and um, and really become just part of who he is. Um, and his work is unmistakable. You can spot a Dr. George piece from miles away and I'm not the only one that thinks that. Um, he's made a huge impact on our hospital, on our art therapy program through a ton of generous support um, from him and his family and friends of his um, we, we would not be where we are today without, without Dr. George and the art therapy program would look very different than it does. So we thank him for allowing us to display his work. And, um, I know that personally I am grateful to have had what started off as, you know, just a normal working relationship with a patient turn into something so much more. So thank you, Dr. George.